like it's been hit because it's collapsed and they're forced to move out and you can see they're firing into it there. So there obviously must have been someone, uh, a defender in that position there. So you can see where the defender's coming down now. Um, and again, he's going to have no idea where the enemy are. And there you go. So he's moved down. Um, he's walked straight into them. Issue of the trenches, he's got nowhere to move. It's quite an extensive trench system as well. Looks like it's been there quite a while, uh, especially with the, the overgrowth and stuff. But they're moving up. With trench warfare, guys, when you're clearing through trenches, um, you can see they're throwing grenades ahead. Um, it's meant to be fast. Fast, hard, and aggressive. Normally, you're, you're moving as quick as you can until you get to a point uh, where you turn, then the man covers uh, and then moves up. But as you can see, they're throwing grenades ahead. Generally, you're not recommended to throw grenades like that because if it hits the side and rolls back in, you're done for. You're only really meant to throw grenades around corners during trench warfare just because it stops that chance of fratricide. Another defender here. Um, you can see as he's moved up. This again, this looks like another admin point or a sleeping point where they've dug in. He's went static cold in that point there. So as you can see, they've cleared up that channel to that point. And now he's retreating as they move up. And it's just, it shows you trench warfare, how close they are together. How close the enemy and the friendly are, um, it's, it's just mind-blowing. And this is giving you a really good example of that. So they've stalled here at the start. They're trying to throw grenades over. Um, so what they're trying to do is throw grenades over at that point there. And they're, they're being really accurate. Um, they're throwing grenades. They're firing. Again, I'm very unsure what that guy there is doing. If he is a friendly, um, is he's one of the ones that are clearing it, or if he's defending, he seems to be stuck there. And what is he doing? Well, that's quite a crazy situation to be in. Now it looks like he's in between two attackers. And then, yeah, so that looks like it was a, a, a defender who ran away and he's been left there um, and he's been stuck in one of the side channels, which is pretty insane. And they're still throwing grenades up at him. That's going to land right next to him. Oh, and he's managed to throw that grenade. He's picked up a grenade and thrown it away. That is insane. I don't think I've ever seen that in real footage, someone picking up a grenade and throwing it away. Another one. So he's obviously in a position he has been hit. Um, and, he, and he fought to the end there. That's a mind-blowing bit of footage here. So he's fought right to the end, um, including throwing grenades away. And again, it's got that point. Now it's just going to be endless grenades. Um, they, they faced a bit of resistance there and they're just going to keep throwing grenades. Um, and like I said, unless you're throwing grenades around corners, it's, um, it, 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 it's giving them the opportunity to throw grenades back like that. And again, they're landing everywhere. They're landing on the side of the trench. There's a possibility to roll back. 